Come on. Can you guys see me? You might have to refresh. Can you guys see me? Because my recording stopped for some reason. I don't know why. If you, if you can't see me, you need to refresh. <clears throat> That's weird. How is the... I put it on high quality tonight, so maybe... <clears throat> you can see me. Okay, good. Thank you, Linda. So maybe that has something to do with it. You did. Thank you, Deborah. Hi. So I'll see. If it keeps cutting off, I'll have to go back to the medium. But everybody else switched to high, so it should be... Hopefully, it should be okay. All right. So I have my tape on there. I always only take off of one side. You can see me. Okay, good. And then I... This way you can like measure where you want. Make sure you have it where you want before you lay it down. And then I go back and I peel the rest of the tape off. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Thanks, Jean. Oh my gosh. Did you see Jean's? She did some glitter jean if you can do those glitter balls you can handle splats <laughs> oh my god she had glitter everywhere and she hates glitter <laughs> all right so so what I, I think i'm going to do it so that i can have a mat here so i could put a uh, journaling spot there so i'm only going to um put it on three sides so. Nope, don't like spots. But you did glitter. Glitter is worse than that. So unfortunately on this, you cannot use like scotch, um, you know, quick dry. So if my, I'm just going to do my mat so that they're a little bit smaller so they don't get um, stuck. <laughs> oh my gosh, Jean. Jean, Jean, Jean. <laughs> I like doing it with the water base because it's water based, the markers, and it just comes right off with water. <laughs> All right. So, see, so we'll have a pocket here so that I can do a little journaling card. <laughs> so, again, I'm just taking it off of one side so that I can go ahead and see where I want this <laughs> yeah you can wash off the paint but you can't glitter oh my gosh she had it everywhere <laughs> she probably still has it She doesn't like splots on her work. You're not going to get her to do it. All right, so I have this here. So I'm going to ink this. So I'm going to use um, Walnut Stain. It's a little dark, but I kind of like it. So I'm just going to ink the edges. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to put this down and I'm going to actually add a piece of score tape too, just to make sure it's down. <laughs> What'd you say? But I like it when it looks... I like what it looks like when it's down. <laughs> That's good. All right, so I'm going to lay this this way. I'm going to put the Merry Christmas right here. Like that. All right, so we have that down. Oh, isn't he cute? So now I want to let me see if I can switch this paper over. Oops. You can see it better, maybe. Like that. 
I'm trying to fix it here. So there we go. Yep. <laughs> she doesn't like spots. No talking her into it. All right, so now should I keep the green? <clears throat> and I love this. And you're going to be able to see that through the other side. Make sure I have the right side. Yeah. Should I keep the green or not keep the green? I have that. This on this side. What do you think? Should I keep the green or not keep the green? Well, I have this on there like that. This little red one here. I'm keeping the green. I'm going to keep the green. So now I need some glue dots. Why glue dots? Why are they? Hmm. Let's see where those are. Well, hold on a second. I'm looking for my glue dots. All right, I'll have to just use some score tape. I really need glue. Oh, here, here they are. Got them, got them, got them. Glue dots. Oh, these are tiny ones. I need the bigger ones. Where are my glue dots? Hold on, I get a lot. Hold on. I need another drawer. Maybe I could use these. These will probably work. These are the line strips. I don't really like this, but those are too little. All right, so I'm going to lay that down. <laughs> I'm gonna lay that down right there. That there. Oh my gosh, you guys still here? <laughs> or are you just watching intently? Unless my chat hasn't moved at all. Are you guys still here? Let me test it. Yeah. I guess you guys are just watching. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can't really use... Um, a glue gun gets just going to pop off. Um, but I always use um, either glue dots or score tape. You're here. Okay, good. <laughs> You're here. Okay. <laughs> Stick that down like that. I wish I had my other glue dots, my big ones. I just don't see where they are. Watching. Okay, good. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> I usually like they I usually like those glue dots that are like super sticky. There we go. On this one, I'll use these little ones. Let's put it because we have them on here. I'm going to stick this one in here. Hi, Linda! <laughs> Stick 
this down in here like that this one I'm going to put the little glue dots on here because this one I can put it on well, maybe it won't stick on this no I have to go with score tape on this one there we go So hopefully, I don't know if anybody's doing this as a present or a gift, but I'm hoping we get it done just before Christmas. I'm going to stick this right down in here. Like that. Then we'll put this other flower here. What did I say? This one here. I wanted to put like the number 25. I have that somewhere too. I'm going to stick this one down here. And this little beige one down in here. And I'm going to cut these leaves. I'm going to stick that down there. And then let's see if this one will be in here. I'm going to do, I could put glitter on this one. I need a truck, another truck of little flowers. If you could see the bag that's to my right, you would be like, I do not need any more flowers. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so then we're going to stick those. So we're going to stick that down there like that. Okay, I'm going to stick this one on. <laughs> I must be running out by now. <laughs> Well, this is the first time I'm using this collection, but I want to make some tags and stuff. So. My gosh, it's freezing here today. <laughs> I don't know how you girls can resist these flowers. How can you resist them? <laughs> All right, there we go. <laughs> Are you guys working on anything? And we got all your uh, all your things done. Let's stick this one right up in there. There, there. Oh, we didn't stick this one in here. Let's fix this. <laughs> it's filled. It filled a twenty-pound box shipping. <laughs> The flowers are light. Did you see the new Prima stuff? It's just starting to show on the blog now. They showed Finnebar's new. Finnebar's got some new paintbrushes. Let's stick that there. Let's stick that there. Did you see your paintbrushes? Oh no, it's freezing. <laughs> um. So it's a paintbrush on one side, and then it's like a um, catalyst on the other side. It's pretty cool. 
You hate hiding your paper with flowers. I'm not hiding any paper, June. <laughs> I mean, Jean. <laughs> I don't like this flower here. What am I going to do with this flower? I don't like it. Look, look how cute that looks. Can you see? And so then we have to see, now we'll have to hide all this glue here in the back. So, all right. So I think I'm going to add just a couple more. I want to add. I have to use all these flowers, so I've got to put them in here. <laughs> I just have to. That's right, Linda. You can always buy more paper. Wow, where are you going to get these gorgeous flowers from? There's that. <laughs> that one. <laughs> Who's feeding off of that? <laughs> I can't believe she doesn't like flowers. How can you not like the flowers? Look how pretty that looks. See? And when this all crackles on the side here, oh my gosh, that's going to look so pretty. All right. So I think I have enough on there now. I got that, that. Did I put everything else on there? Oh, I didn't put my little, my little thing here. <laughs> Stick this in here. See that? Look how cute. I love this collection. Love it. All right. So I'm trying to see. I had a number, like a little number 25. I'm going to stick up in there. I might have to look for that later if I can't find it. Let's see. I have that. I don't know if I want that in there. No. Do you want to put my little horse in there? You love it? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Cute. I want to put my little horse in here, though. My little. Oh my gosh, I wish I would have bought more of these. These were at Michael's, and I used those for the um, cookie cutter ornaments I did like Miranda oh my gosh they're so cute so this one I will put some um, glue thanks <laughs> when we take off the back you'll see how pretty it really looks I'm just gonna stick this right here <laughs> cute <laughs> thanks, thanks, Janelle. All right, so we have our front cover done. Cute. I don't think I need to add anything else more to that. So now I might put some like white gesso and stuff like that just to like, um, you know, I wanted to, um, I think I'm going to round my corners. I don't think I want them pointing. What's this one's quarter? We want half. I meant to do that before. I'm going to stick this in here. So I'm just rounding them off. I think they would look better than pointy. So there we go. <laughs> All right. So now we're going to peel off the back. Thing, pull off that flat back piece so now we've got to cover all the glue that we had there but see how pretty it looks now that it's clear look at that cute 
cute. I don't want to move my mirror. I want to be able to see the Merry Christmas. All right. So you can see now. I don't know if you can see now. It's starting to crackle. Let's see if you can see it there. Right here. It's, so by the night, it'll all be crackled. So that'll look really nice. All right. So let's get to the back. So on the back, I'm going to put my Christmas tree. So I'm going to. So this is going to go over right like this. And then we have to decide what we're going to put here and whether I'm going to put a tag or something like that. Or um, what else we could put. So the tree's going there. That's going to go behind the tree like that. So we need some more flowers. <laughs> more flowers, I mean. <laughs> so let's see. So now on this side, I don't, I don't want it to be like too puffy, the flowers. So let's pick out some that are flat. Every time I, I, I look at this, I almost want to say, like Frank does, this is number 583422. <laughs> I like flowers, so are you grow them in your garden. Oh, nice. So this one's a really pretty one. Look at that. That's really pretty. And it's got the little pea. I don't know if you can see it's got the two little girls in there. So we could put that in there. And this one's got green leaves. So we could put the green leaves on this side. So we just want to make sure that we cover up all our. Let's see what other one I have. I have that. I also made some. Oh, let me see. Where is my. Oh, there's my 25. <laughs> so I want to cut this. And hopefully we'll make some tags too tonight. <clears throat> All right, so I'm gonna I'll put that. Remind me, I'll put that on the other side when we get after I do this side. <coughs> what is going on with my chat? <laughs> you can find limited size in the hardware store. A font, limited size of what? Thickers, transparencies, or the plastic. All right, so let's see. I have some other flowers here. I want to go with kind of the flat ones because I don't want to um, get too high. Like a thin plexiglass here. Should we go with the green? I don't like green. I'm going to go with this one. Pull that one. We need some littler ones. I wish I would have bought more of these little ones. <laughs> oh, you know what I have too? I have some that I made. Not that I needed to make any, but I did make them. So let's see what else do we have here. I love these. These with all the little crystal parts on there. That's pretty too. Well, let me put the picture down first. Oh, see, and then if I want to pull something out, I'm not. I'm gonna to have to pull something out from the top because I'll have all these flowers in the way. So let's glue this down first. And I want to ink this. Let's glue this down. And then I have this cute little um, sled. I don't know if I'm going to put this on the... I cut out the Merry Christmas. 
And I can't, this is a magnolia die, but I love this cute little um, gold sled on here. Maybe we'll put it on this page, we'll see. So this is a magnolia doohickey die. The little sl Santa sled. Did you show the magical box? What magical box? <laughs> What magical box, Jeannie? A frog? Where's there a frog? I can see a frog. Oh, so now I'm going to, oh yeah, this one, I'm going to close up. I don't know, let me say, oh, 20 pound box of stuff. <laughs> She's pulling your leg. <laughs> All right, pull this one off. They got rid of the uh, Prima Warehouse boxes. No more Prima Warehouse. All closed up. I did think they were going to start, Frank said they're going to start the special deliveries up in January again. You never know with Eileen. <laughs> Alright, so this one I'm going to have the tag come out from the top. So I'm only going to put tape on the bottom and sides. A chipboard piece with the candles on it. Chipboard piece. Oh, <laughs> the frog, the frog. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. Poor Jean Marie. I think Ella threw it out on you, though. I hope she did. <laughs> When they were in Ella's stream, everybody was saying that this looked like a frog. <laughs> this looked like a frog with the two eyes and that. <laughs> it looks like a frog. My tree will cover it, so it won't be too bad. <laughs> Special delivery box. They have they put a box together every month. Um, with different products and they call it the special delivery box and they um, they have it every month and you they I think they do like shows on it what you what you can get um, but some of them I did I did get one one time because they had stamps in there that old stamps that I wanted <laughs> tree frog <laughs> you're sure she's mailing it to you <laughs> Yeah, I forget how much product is in there when I put that on a little cricket, but it won't matter. I'm going to put it on there so it looks okay. Put a little cricket. Should be able to take it off though. That's the nice thing about acrylic that you could just pull this right off. Oh, I thought you could. Yeah, you should. So for this one, it's a little bit stuck down. There we go. All right, line this back up. No, I don't have my. There we go. Yeah, it's a little high up at the top. Oh well. Oh well. All right. So I'm gonna put my frog down 
And I think I want to pop it up. Should I pop it up or maybe I'll pop the tree up and pop that down. That's what I'll do. And did you see my quick drive? Where is that? There it is. Two things about one people <laughs> show up an hour early because everyone fights over getting the project. <laughs> uh, well, the penguin canvas is going to get to its destination on Friday. And then all the little ornaments should be there by Friday and I think the weekend. So I'll we'll have to check it out, see who it is. <coughs> Hi, Torque. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to glue this down. And then I'm going to pop my tree up. And I already went around it with um, a distress marker around the edges. So. Hi, CB. <laughs> I showed my shade tree, my shell trees um, earlier. Have to, if I find the pictures, I'll again, well, I'll show them to you. Post office, yeah. Mine was busy today too. Although my mail has been, I mean, the, my happy mail has been like getting forever to get people. I don't know why that is. All right. So here's my Christmas tree. So I think I'm going to put it right here in the middle. So there you go. See, see how cute that is. So now our flowers. Oh, I should have decided whether I wanted to put this on here or not in the background. Is that a Paula's? Yeah, Paula is my secret sister. Yep. I showed it at, um, oh, Paula's showing, oh, she's showing her box. Oh, that's good. Yeah, she. I showed mine on Monday night. All right, so we have to decide what flowers do I want to put on here. And I'm going to go with the green. The green on there like that. I like this one. Like that. And so we'll see what's on the other side. So see, you'll be able to see the green leaves on this side. So, so I like that. I'm not sure put the little girls standing up. And I like that. So we have to add a few more flowers. So I think I want, I think I'm going to add this little sled here too. Just here. Like that. Maybe back here like this. And then, oh, let's see what else. What else do we have? I can either do that or I can add one of these chipboard. I have this, the little box. Put the Noel in there. We did Merry Christmas already. Noel. Noel. Oh, I think I like the I think I like the sled. Because it goes with all that gold that's around there. So let's see what other flowers we have that we can put in here. I need some little ones. Little flowers. I can't find my little ones. I thought I'm looking, looking for flowers. I had some smaller ones and I don't know where they are. Hi, Ash. 
<laughs> you just woke up. Oh no. <laughs> you just woke up. I'm looking for some more flowers. We have those out. I have those out. That's there they are. There we go. Got that. Maybe I'll put some sequins down. <laughs> In half an hour, forget about the what? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna add a couple of these little flowers. So I think I'll put this one. I think I'll add some of these. Maybe some of these green ones. Put a green one there. Not that dark one. This one's really bright red. Maybe I'll stick that one there for five. And maybe one more. Maybe a beige one. So that looks cute. So I think I'm going to put those down. And then maybe I'll put a couple of these sequins down. I'm wondering where if I should put that. I'll oh, wait. And then we have some of these little berries. Maybe we could put some of those down. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to glue this. This needs to get a little. I have to poke these things out. Then it won't poke out. Little dots. I think that's it. So I think I'm going to glue that down just like that. Uh, okay, Linda. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> All right. Where is my glue? There it is. So I'm going to add a little glue on here. On this. This is just some gold paper that I had in my stash. There we go. So I'm going to stick that right there. And then I'm going to stick these down. Keep getting under your, oh, your fingernails, typing errors. <laughs> All right, and then did you see, here we are. I'm gonna put these down, and then I'll show you how the these flowers will show on the other side. So I'm just gonna stick this down. that and don't forget this week spellbinders has their um, sneak peek and Seth will be showing his dies on Friday and then Prima's got theirs I haven't seen anything else from graphic 45 yet down in here. Hi, Gwen. <laughs> this goes here. Make sure it's tucked under there. Hey, Carrie. Can see you there.
Yeah, her cute little slippers for her niece. Is that for your niece? They're so cute. And she's knitting all kinds of slippers. And I probably will go back and put a little bit of fabric tack on here just because. There, and then one more down here. Oh, her grand niece, she did it for. All right, I'm gonna stick the, this one right here. All right, so there's this page. You see, you see that? So, whoops, let me move that. So now when you go on this side, you can see the green leaves that we put on the other side there, and then not too much of the other flowers. But, you love the red flower? Oh my gosh, that looks so cute, 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 cute. So then we have that, yeah. So then we have that. So that's my Christmas tree, and then we're going to do a couple tags to go on the inside. That's probably... I don't know if I want to put it like a word here or something. Let me just look at the chipboard pieces and see what we have in here. My card chip. <laughs> Let me just see what I have here. December, Noel. Oh, the Santa would have been cute if I'd have moved the tree over a little. I can should I put the Santa in there I think they would look cute in there the problem is that you're gonna see them on the back though unless I stick them I should have moved the tree over just a tad if I put the Santa in there the only problem was that is see then you see the back part of it like I'd have to cover it oh thanks Ash <laughs> I think he would look cute on there, like he's um, putting presents on the tree, right? So let's ink him up, and then I got to cover the back of him. Yes, looks cute. <laughs> Thanks. All right, so we need a scrap piece for the back. So maybe I can just use, let's see what I have here, this dot piece. Just add more flowers. <laughs> I could do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to cover this back piece here. Um, just going to cut a little piece from here. I only need to do just that part of them. So I'm going to pull this off. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, Karchi. And then I'm going to add this right to the back of them. Like that. And then just trim this out. Should use my knife really. Let's ink the back of this. <laughs> we'll see if I can't cover it up what it looks like. I might have to add some more flowers. <laughs> We'll see, Jeannie. All right, so then I'm going to just tuck this right on there. And then I have to glue this little sled part there. There we go. 
All right, so let's see what it looks like in the back. So it's not too bad. We'll see. I might. Well, it depends. I might have to put a. I might have to put a flower on that side. Maybe. <laughs> I just might have to do it. Oh, I can't get me. Trying to get this back in. There we go. If I put, oh, let's see. Not like that. I think just that, and maybe one little flower. Maybe this one with the music notes. Like that. That looks cute. I think I'll add that on there. <laughs> you can't imagine working on two sides. Oh, it's not that bad. Because you do the first side, and then whatever you do on the first side dictates what you're going to do on the second side. So, so now remember, I had I'll have to put just a smaller tag in here. Carol. <laughs> All right, then I'm going to stick this little one right there. There. So see? So now that kind of covers that up and it still looks cute and more more flowers the better. <laughs> might have to add the 1 2 3, you know I don't like. Might have to add just a tiny bit. Oh, you know what I didn't add on here was, where is it? Hold on a second. Looking for. Jingle bells. Nope, not that. I'm going to put this key, this key it says joy. I'll hang that off of the uh, rings. He didn't put any of these, his pearls. Oh my gosh, gotta put some pearls on there. Okay, Chanel, bye. Thank you. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> All right. Hi, Jen. How are you? All right, so I'm going to add a couple of these beads on here just because, because he does. I'm going to have to add those on with some fabric tack. That looks cute. <laughs> Hi, Suzanne. We forgot the beads. How are things upside down? Oh, upside down for Jen. <laughs> so I'm just going to use some fabric tack to put all this down. Pearls, yep, yeah, pearls. These are Frank's pearls. One, two, three. I'll make some tiny little gold ones. Oops. And since we're going to go on, I think we're maybe we'll do the tags that go in the back here. You can't believe the author. <laughs> Well, he puts pearls on his stuff, so it just looks so cute. <laughs> oh, that's good, Jen. Let me get 
my fingers out of there. Two, one, two, three, and then we need a big one. I think I put another gold one. Small. Oh, I want a tiny one. You've been looking for pearls, but you can't find them. We have a place, not the dollar, our dollar store has some pearls, like they have like white and pink and blue, but um, not the gold and black, golden like burgundy that these are. Doesn't that look just cute? Just add something to it. <laughs> I bet that was a bit of a scare, I bet. So see how cute that looks? Just adding the little pearls on there. So there's that one, and then that one, and then down there. <laughs> how nice that looks. All right. So shall we do the tags to go inside? I didn't even add any of these little berries either. Cute little berries. I might have to add one on this side. Just one of these little on this side. Just right there. I'm just going to add that right there. All right, so now we're done with this page, except for our tags. The cute little berry, and then the pearls. It doesn't make a big difference. All right, so I'm thinking for the tags, <clears throat> I really want to use my, let me put these away. Let me get almost, let me clear some of this mess out of the way. <laughs> that goes in there. These go in here. And then I think I'm going to have to add some, some like white gesso or something on these flowers here. So I just want to see it's starting to crack. Now you can see it's starting to crack. It's going to look cool, cracked. Oh, thanks, Colleen. Yeah, it looks cool with the um the little pearls. All right, so let, let me move this on this side, and let's do some tags. Let me get my little evolution so I have this and then I have these dies so I have these remember these these are something like Tim's distress but these are snowflakes trees and ornaments so what I want to do is I'm going to take my little six by six pad And we have to decide what paper should we use. Let's use one of these. We can use that. And because we're going to be cutting out. So I'm trying to think if I cut something a little bit there, maybe one of these. I'm going to cut these into three by six. Hi, Debbie. <laughs> Move this over a little bit. So I'm going to cut this off. And then do three by six. So these will be three by six. And they should fit into those pockets, hopefully, pretty well. We'll test it out. Three by six. 
Yeah, that was scary. Like that. And then three by six. So I want to see if I could do it on my little revolution because my cuddle bug is downstairs. So what we're going to do is, let me just test it to see if it will go in this. I'm going to have to be careful because of those. So this should, yep, that one fits right in there. Perfect in the back. So we have the Christmas tree. Well, if we could put this tag with the Christmas tree. You love the vintage papers? Yeah. They're cute. I love this whole collection. I'm not really like a real vintage person, but I just love this collection. I love the flowers. I love everything about it. So this comes with four dies, and this one's called a Distress Holiday Collage. What's nice is they come with this little magnet, too, which is great. Oh, I didn't clean this out last time. I need a pin. Jesus. And clean these out. Since this is an acrylic album, I thought this would be like cool looking because it'll be see through too. So, so what we're gonna do is let's ink this up first. This page isn't for photos. Yeah, my that was my tree. My, the front page had the Santa, my Santa, and then the second part had my tree. And then this will be like a little journaling card. I could put a, depends on how we cut it, how, we, how it is. I'm blank for a minute. Oh, no. All right, so what I'm going to do is I want to take this. I think I'm going to do this with the Christmas tree. Let's see. The Christmas tree has to go. Has to go on that side. So if we cut the Christmas tree here and then maybe do maybe do the ornaments on this side. So if I do this and this. So we're going to try to do this. That's what I'm going to try to do. So what I need is some washi tape. Some crummy washi tape. I want to hold this down. <laughs> no, no, that's my Santa. He wears a blue. He has a dark, it's like a royal blue outfit he has on. But I changed it to, um, not sepia, it was called antique. And so that's why you, it looks like it's silver, but it's really like a royal blue. So that's my Santa. And then on this page is my Christmas tree from this year. <laughs> I just thought it was a random no that's my Santa I have a Santa oh actually I have like three or four Santas alright so I'm going to just glue this down with my tape because I want that to go and then I, um, this is only four inches um, so I have to do one at a time so we're going to put this down first and hopefully I don't get any lines this is the first time I'm using this die, so hopefully it will work. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at how cute the little trees. So see how cute that looks? Just that little piece. I don't know where my pin is. I'll have to just poke it out with this. Oh, maybe not. There we go. And then now we're going to, and look, then we have all these cute little Christmas trees. And now we're going to put the <coughs> ornaments on this side. So I'm going to glue this one down like this. <clears throat> and that 
see how cute? So the tag is kind of like our acrylic. So it's, um, you know, see-through. All right, so let's move this out of the way so you guys can see. <clears throat> So you could do, if you have Tim's distress, um, <clears throat> his distress dies are similar to these. <clears throat> you can make tags just like these. So we have all those cute little ornaments. I could put them on my tree last time. <laughs> and we have all the little trees. And then we're going to do one with snowflakes. So I'm just going to pop these out. So there we are. So now let's see. We can't really build these up too high because it has to go behind the pocket. Get this one out. So there we go. So we have all that. You need to go to bed early. <laughs> now what we can do is um, I might be able to put some of these flowers in here but I probably have to take off the little centers because um, it won't go behind the, um, the tag so if we did something like this something like this What else can we put on here? I have another little, some of those little flowers. Kind of like the green. I didn't use too many of the green ones. Maybe the green. I wish I would have bought more of these too. I don't have that many of these. <laughs> so let's see. Um, I'm looking for my tiny little flowers. See where those are? There we go. These. So we do one of maybe one of these. So we do something like that, but we've got to take the centers off or they're not going to fit. So that's cute like that. I like to cut out this little Santa and maybe have him peeking through. So let's do that. I'm just going to take my marker. I'll just get rid of that white part. I'll have him peeking up through, through this little flower like this. Oh, it's cute. You see? So it'll be up like this. Looks just like that. A cute little tag. And then I could write something, you know, whatever, you know, what our tree, what kind of tree it was. So I'm going to add those down. So I'm going to put them down with fabric tack. I'm going to pull those little things off the center. So I have to cut them off. And then maybe what I'll do is I'll just stickle in the inside. Thanks, Jeannie. I like the, I, I like the idea of the tags being also see-through to go with the acrylic album. So I thought that was uh, cute.
trying to get that off. We could maybe just put like sequins in the middle. Let me get them down first and we'll see. So I have that one there. I'll get this one down. that one and then our little Santa <laughs> let's see see how cute and then I can write down what kind of tree it is. And I like to do that. I always like to write down because we get different trees for different years. Um, and then up through this little, where that, I don't have to put a hole in it because where this Christmas tree is, is I will put my ribbon through that. So let's see. What else can we put on here? I just want to see what else I have. Oh, my little sequins. I think we're going to put the little sequins. Because, we, again, we can't put anything bulky because it's going in the pocket. So. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Start after packing your stuff. Poor Jen. She has a lot. But you're pretty well organized, aren't you, Jen? So let's see, I'm going to put a gold one here. I'll put them maybe a red in this one. And then I think I'm going to take a green one. Lime green. Or this copper. Copper one in there. Maybe green. Oh, she's not streaming. She's got a pack. All right, so let's get these down. <laughs> yeah, just turn the camera. That's what I did when I was rearranging my place, and everybody just came and chat. You could do that. So I'm just going to lay these sequins down. Maybe. <laughs> could just put stickles in here too. I mean, if they don't stay, I'll have to just um, add some stickles on here. That, and then this little one. So there we are. So I don't have any ribbon. I'll have to get some ribbon. But look how cute that looks. Cute. Right. So that's our one. So that'll be for the one page. Move these over. And I think we'll do one more. And I want that one to go. Let's see how we're going to put that on this page. If I was to go inside, maybe this, let's see, if we have room. Yeah, I can fit this one this way. So I'll just have to cut it a little shorter. So it's got it. So we could do, hmm, could do the December. I could take this December 25, cut this off. Maybe that's what I'll do. Or I could put the 25 on there. Hmm. Oh no, what happened to my chat? Hold on, my chat's gone. Hold on. What is going on with that tonight? There you go. <laughs> Thank you, Carol. <laughs> it's coming out cute. I think it'll be really pretty. All right, so we need to cut this so that we can slide this inside there. 
I just can't decide if I, I want to put this December 25th in the corner there or keep the 25 maybe put the 25 Merry Christmas December oh let's see I think I'll keep that so I think I need to cut it right there and then maybe I can use a 25 for somewhere else so let's go for a quarter So this will go inside here. I'm gonna have to cut it just even though well, I could leave it like that with the December 25 sticking out. What do you think? I think I should cut it so it's just barely. I like it though. I don't want to cover like the whole thing up, you know what I mean? So I'm thinking I gotta go all the way in. So I gotta cut like another half inch off. Talking to myself. <laughs> all right, so let's edge this. Then I'll have to put some little thing that we could pull it out for the tag. So I think I want to do another one of these. So we could do um, the snowflake. That goes that way. If I do the snowflake, I could do it sideways like this. I really want it so that it's up at the top. Oh, I can do it on this side. That's what I can do. I'll do it on that side. So, or do I want it on? Maybe I'll do it like this. I'll do it like that. So it's gonna go like this. So it's gonna go like this. So I'm gonna tape this down on this side. Like that. Take the machine back out. I can't reach. Pull this out. Hopefully these come out. Yeah, they do. Cute. So see, there's that one. And then I can write something. I can journal a little bit inside there. I'll just pull this out. Ah. See how cute that is? So this is the one that will go inside here. And so then you can see it still has, it still could have gone a little shorter. I'm thinking I could use this. I'm going to cut this and use this as my little pullout tab. So 
then this will go in here like this. See, and then I can just say December. And so then that tag will go in there just like that. Thanks, Carol. <laughs> Coming out cute, cute, cute. And so then this one now will get some ribbon, which I don't know if I have any ribbon. I have some of this. Maybe some of this gold twine. Let's see. Here we go. Ooh, thanks. So I can put that right through this little part of the tree here. So I don't have to make a little hole. And then pull this through. So there we are. Isn't that cute? The little frilly. And so then this will go behind here. I'm just hoping that these flowers will stay. Oh yeah. There we go. It almost looks like that's like the star on the tree, isn't it? <laughs> Might have to cut this just a little bit shorter. This one a little bit shorter. There we go. So see, I gotta glue this part down so this doesn't flop all over. So I need a little glue dot. Oh, thanks. <laughs> so I just want to glue this down. There. So now that doesn't flop on that side. So now you could see you could see this on this side. And now you can see the flowers here just behind a little Santa. Cute. And then we have that. So there we go. So let's see. Um, for our second page. So let me get this out. And I'm just going to talk it through because I um, I'll have to decide now. Well, let me put this away first. <laughs> Two pages. Yeah, on one sheet. Oh, pretty good. So I move this. I love these distressed um, dies. Well, you know I love dies anyway. So <laughs> I do. All right. So that's going back in this. Thanks, Jen. In there, back in this. All right, so so now for my next page, I got to take this part off. This is the glue part. And I know I want to do the corners half inch so let's get that going next there we go and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my gold um, stays on wherever that is <laughs> gold stays on. You see it? My gold stays on. <laughs> My desk is like a wreck. My gold stays on. Where is it? Find my, my stuff. Hold on, looking, looking, looking. Don't get that. That's all. 
my gosh. Oh, right beside me. Hello. <laughs> so, and it's what it's so stuck on this one. I don't know why I have such a hard time getting this off. Oh my gosh. I know. Don't yell at me. I know I shouldn't be doing it with scissors, but I can't get it off. There it is. It's like overspilt in it. Ugh. This one's a mess. There we go. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a sponge. I can find one. And we're going to do just the eggs. Do the sides. So I'm going to just ink the edges. And pretty much I'm going to do that with all my pages. I might do something fancy with the last one. So there we go. And it dries pretty quick. Not too bad. There. So now what we have to think about when we do this page, I have to decide what I want to do. Like if I want to do a horizontal or another vertical, I think I'm going to go horizontal on this one. But I'm going to stop here so this way I can print out some pictures and decide what I want because those other pictures aren't going to work. <laughs> They're just not going to work. Oh, here we go. So see here, CB, this was my oyster tree that I got this year. And these are my other shell trees. <laughs> so, but see how this blue just does not go. So I'm going to print out my pictures in the sepia or the antique. And so then next week we'll start with this page. And I think I'm going to make this album about six pages. So we've already done the, these two. So hopefully next week we'll get at least four done. And then the other, hopefully we can finish it like just before Christmas. So if you guys have any questions? Any questions? So, so yeah, I love the way that the first two pages came out. I love the little, I love this. Santa. <laughs> you love the tree? That's my tree this year. It's a small tree. Usually we have a bigger tree than that. And then you can see this is how most of my Santas are. They've got that big blue um, thing. It's a shell. Yep. Yeah. It's got fishies on it, mermaids. Mm -hmm. So yeah. So you can see, well you guys can't see, but I'll have to show you close up next week. That is starting to crack. So it should look pretty cool by tomorrow. So, any other questions? Oh, thanks, CB. <laughs> thanks, Linda. All right, well, have a good weekend, and um, I'll be on Sunday. I'm not sure what I'm going to do Sunday, but um, he's chubby cheeks. He does. He does have chubby cheeks. His poor little nose, I got to paint it up. It's like scratched off. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. My pleasure, Colleen. All right, have a good night. I'll see you guys hopefully on Sunday. Hey, Darcy. <laughs> All right, so have a good night. Have a good week. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, CB. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs>